Wait, why? <laughs> I love him. <laughs> He's funny. How do they know the moves? And I'm dead, right? God dang it! <laughs> And there's Caitlyn. What do we have here? A man with a rain cloud over his head. <laughs> so how about a reading to clear those somber skies? Whether it be dark or bright, I'll need your future right. Just then go shooting the messenger. Eh? I like the oh, voice. Some kind of toy. You see, lads, eyes up here. <laughs> <laughs> Kate Seth, fortune teller extraordinaire. Put it there. <laughs> it's a toy, all right. Pretty lifelike, though. Come on, pal. Give us a smile. <laughs> the gold saucer is meant to be a happy place filled with happy people, don't you know? So show us those pearly whites. Back off. What is this accent? Is this. Someone's got a bee in their bonnet. Is it Scottish? I don't know. Strange. Most folks like me. I wanna say maybe something something British. Maybe maybe Scottish. I'm not quite sure. I have to hear more of his voice later. Yeah. Can we talk to the cat? All those controls are moving away, but I don't see it all the time. That would be nice. And hello? Cat? Cat? No? Nothing? Okay. Uh anything here? No? Okay, for now it seems like fairly linear. What is this? Um, I can't get to it. Am I supposed to go a different way? Why? This is already weird. Why can't I, why can't I get to it? Um, maybe there's a way through here? Through the, through the woods? Alright, if the puzzles are like this, uh, I don't like it. <laughs> it's not intuitive whatsoever. It feels like I have to go up. Don't tell me it's because I'm playing on the PS5. This would be just bad. How am I supposed to get there? Maybe I should... Let's talk to the cat again. Maybe you can talk to the cat now. Uh, the cat is gone. Okay. Is there a different path? A different way? Okay, I'm already confused. Yeah, I can't reach it. That's so weird. Wait a second. Um... I have to press X, not circle. Wait. Why? Why are the controls different? Square was the same and triangle was the same, but X and circle are just different. Okay. Unless he has been with Muthos all along. The mark of the phoenix emblazoned upon his heart, made manifest by the power of will alone. The power of creation. Can it be? Are there wills? Truly so potent. Are you still talking? <laughs> <laughs> Hello again. Nowhere to stay? And what's it to you? Now then, did you want one sweet or two? Oh, you trying to scam us? I wouldn't need dream of such a thing. And to prove it, I'll foot the entire bill myself. Sure you will. Well, aren't we a prickly bunch? <laughs> <laughs> I love him. <laughs> He's funny. You there, dangly man. Would you mind checking one more time? Hmm? Hmm. Oh, a timely cancellation. <laughs> The Tonberian Elagor sweets have just become available. Okay. Shall I book them for you? <laughs> it feels so good to do good. All right, lads. Enjoy your stay. <laughs> Toodaloo. Your sweets are on the fourth floor. Please proceed to the elevator at the top of the stairs. Thanks. So, I have to spoil a little bit, because I think it will still be the same like in the original. Kate Sith is very nice and he says it feels good to do something good. Well, for now, because he's tricking us, because he's actually... Wait, isn't he controlled by oh, one of Chinra's guys? What's his name? Can't remember. I'm gonna put it here. 
and we will see what will happen next. But then again, like I said, he's working for Shinra for now. So this is why he's doing good in a way. So good in quotation marks, just to keep us happy and uh, not suspicious of the character that he actually is. Yeah, yeah. But this is not healthy, hanging upside down for a long period of time. Because the blood is rushing to your head. It says here you cancelled those rooms? Ha! What? Like I no, said, Kate works for Shinra. While we did have you booked for the Tonberry and Elagor suites, Mr. Palmer sent word that they were no longer required. That's impossible. Sang, that's a stain. Now I remember. Wrong. Come on. How do they know the moves? <laughs> what the? Get off. <laughs> Uh, Andrea, sure. Oh, it's dance off. Mm -hmm. Nice try. Oh. The floor's on the floor. <laughs> okay, then I have to talk to him. There's someone invisible there. Talk. Uh, I'm busy, so busy. Lend a hand. Oh, thank you. Don't cut off my hand, please. The invisible person grabs your arm. They push your wrist onto the cutting board. I thought so! A hand is exactly what I needed. Ah, oh, fucking hell. Taken literally. Yeah, yeah, I thought so. This was so obvious. <laughs> Welcome to our gilded paradise, the Gold Saucer. <laughs> Theo, <Thanks>. our director. <laughs> Tonberries are kind of scary, if you ask me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you nice wordplay. Cut in line and you get cut. <laughs> or stabbed. I want this fireball. I want this as a as a as a, as a light in my room. <laughs> so cool. Always do. Honest and true. But, <laughs> let me guess. You don't like dumb rhymes. <laughs> <laughs> no, I like rhymes. Me too. Sometimes. <laughs> Cute. <laughs> Not bad, kid. Yeah, looks like we're moving on. I think we... Ooh. This is nice. Coolio. It's like an escalator, but way more awesome. I'm quite certain if I do this, I will die. I want to test this, but, but then again, I'm going to save it first. <laughs> it might be fun to actually count how often I will die. <laughs> uh, the chairs are back to normal. Interesting. Quite certain this poison. Quite certain. Really? Sure. And I'm dead, right? Viola was poisoned. Yeah. You heard something unlock. Wait, what? Uh, and I'm dead. <laughs> okay. Teensy little brick. All those in favor? Me. 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 Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. So what do we see? Uh, this reminds me already of uh, Harry Potter with those ghosts in the cafeteria and stuff. Hello! How are you? Welcome to Gryffindor. <laughs> yeah, yeah. For it was as we slept that man committed his greatest sin. He awoke. Alone in a world bereft of his god's radiance, he stumbled blindly, desperate for guidance. Finding no light, he sought to kindle his own. And from that single errant impulse was his will born. <laughs> Having discovered himself at last, man turned his eyes inward and found he desired ever more. Now I understand why he thinks we are flawed. Which only magic might afford. 
Yeah, we have flawed in his eyes because we have our own will. For custody over that dwindling resource. And he can't just and get his vessel. She wept tears of black. If our sin is wanting to survive, then you are as marked by it as we are. The fault is yours. Our wills were born because you abandoned us. And now, you would have us forfeit them. All for a place in your new paradise. Do you imagine yourselves worthy of one? Mankind has no place in our world. Is this truly so difficult to comprehend? We only ever require you, Nuthos, when the time comes to bid this wretched realm farewell. None shall follow, none shall remain. So you're gonna be what alone? None. This is our world. Once the land's rebirth is complete, humanity will have served its purpose. Why would we continue to suffer that which has caused us so much vexation? Because the land doesn't belong to you. It belongs to us all! What? That is where you are mistaken. Yeah, yeah it's you his powers. Nothing but your precious will. Tacky and understaffed. Great. Hello? <laughs> oh, that got me. <laughs> Welcome, gentle sirs. <laughs> what in the hell was that? A jump scare. <laughs> My most sincere apologies. It got me again, god dang it. <laughs> Would you care to join us? Sure. Definitely. I'm starved. <laughs> You're supposed to say thank you. Correct, little girl. Yes, ma'am. No, you're supposed to say it now. Aww. Thank you. I don't want to step into the pool of blood, just in case. Come to my room. How? I have to get into the pool of blood, right? I thought so. Wait. God dang it! <laughs> okay, I have to find the room first somehow. I don't know. Uh, that was a quick first death. <laughs> Something tells me I'm going to have the worst nightmares when I go to bed. I'm getting this tingling up and down my spine. Wait, maybe I've got some kind of sixth sense. <laughs> okay. You can see dead people? Mm hmm. I see dead people. <laughs> More toys. <laughs> oh, I love Tonberry. You're so cute. Alrighty then. Purifying air with prejudice? <laughs> Retribution is at hand. <laughs> this is so cool. Tons of berries. <laughs> That's so funny, I like it. That was quite cool. Alright then, we're gonna take a look around. Let's get started with this one. The handle is moving on its own. There is nothing. A Tonberry! <laughs> Surprise! Oh, this reminds me of, ah, oh, there was one game with a door, and and the door was, you couldn't open it. I, I, I can't remember, I saw it on Game Ranks in a video, and yeah, Turnberry, it's good. 
it's fine. And uh, and but at some point you were able to open the door with sheets or something, and then there was just a stone wall, and it says "fuck you." <laughs> Or fuck off or something. <laughs> that was funny. And like I said, I don't know, don't know which game it was. Yeah, like I, I'm not gonna watch it back because there are too many videos on Game Ranks. But very nice channel, very cool channel up actually. Spiders. Okay. Okay. I didn't look up. Ah, maybe I should look up a little bit. Dude, could you stop talking? <laughs> oh, this chest. It's not real. Yeah, yeah, yeah I thought so. <laughs> I want to test everything before we go to bed. Okay, I can move the chair. Genie. Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. Do you go somewhere? Oh no, you're just going back. Aww. Oh, the book just fell out. Okay. Let's be nice and put it back. Oh, cool. All right, then. I think that's it. Your friend told me the story. One evening, right around midnight, he hears a sound outside his room. So he gets up, goes over to the door, and looks through the people. Sees a new tone very robot. Battered little thing with a huge knife dripping with blood. As he shuffles down the hallway, real slow. Yeah, definitely. Interesting story. I like. Cut off bear's limbs. Yeah, I'm so sorry, Teddy. <laughs> you cut off the teddy bear's limbs. Why is there blood? What the fuck? Got a teddy bear's torso. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Okay. Okay. Yeah, sorry, Teddy. Stuff the teddy bear torso in the basket. You heard something unlock. Yeah, that's the door. Yeah, 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 na, 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 na. Ah! You gotta be fucking kidding me! Oh, holy shit. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. You can answer any question? Of course! Be it this, be it that, go on and ask the cat. <laughs> okay, we're looking for Sephiroth. Think you can find him? Oh, Sephiroth, you say? All right, hold on to your underpants. Meow, 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 meow. <laughs> Things are looking up, so throw caution to the wind. Put your trust in others, and a last minute twist may pleasantly surprise you. Well, it's not pleasant What's this gotta do if they're with trying to get Aerith. What? Indeed. But then again... Give me another hmm. chance. I'll get it this time. Come on! But Rufus said he's not... He's not interested in Aerith anymore. Watch your belongings. Lucky color. Black? Hmm. We're done. I will see. Wait! Don't go! Third time's a charm! Come on, you stupid thing! <laughs> Well, anything the matter? <laughs> Seek and you are sure to find. But alas, you shall forever lose what you cherish most. Hmm. <laughs> the stars work in mysterious ways. <laughs> you good? Well, I'm trying to get a date with yeah, Tifa. It's just what I cherish most? Yeah, what is what what does he cherish uh, most? See what this crap does. <laughs> My apologies, sir. Because 
like I said in the original, they actually scooped up Aerith. And then we had to get to Wutai at some point to get her back, I think. Something like this. But then again, like I said, Rufus said he's not interested in Aerith anymore. Ah, we'll see, we'll see. Too many questions, let's just keep going. <laughs> Very well done. <laughs> Just fainted. <laughs> the way is blocked by a small patch of roses. How do I use it? Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. Let's go back. Let's go back. I want to see if I can cut this down here too. If this is the way back. Just to see if we could go back. Cut roses. I can't even make a dent in them. Okay, so we can't go this way. Then let's try this right here again. This is already like very old school. I'm not used to this anymore. In a way it was similar to return with the mask and stuff. You had to get into the menu and then click on the mask and then you can put it into the doors and stuff. Scratches on the door. The door is jammed and now sports bloody gouges. A rusted nail juts out from the wood. Uh-oh, it's jammed too, and I don't like the look of those. Three bloody scratches mark the door. Wait, that's it? Okay. It was so obvious. Bloody scratches, bloody teeth. Three of each, so... Well, that worked. We can open the door now. What is all this? Ah, oh, yeah. You can pass through now. The machete broke. Ha. Okay. No. So cute. 